never believed the word star. That's an illusion, man. I mean, that's something public calls you. Hello, Mr. Lee. You see, everybody come up to you with Mr. Lee. When you have long hair, they'll say, hey, man, like, that's the in, man, baby. That's the in thing. But if you have no name, they'll say, boy, look at that disgusting juvenile delinquent. I mean, too many people are yes, yes, yes to you all the time. When you become successful, when you become famous, it's very, very easily to be blinded by all these happenings, right? because, I mean, if things are repeated too many times, you believe in it, and it becomes a habit. The word superstar really turned me off, and I'll tell you why. Because the word star, man, is an illusion. It's something what the public calls you. You should look upon oneself as an actor, man. I mean, you would be very pleased if somebody say, hey, man, you are a super actor. It is much better than, you know, superstar. When I first arrived there, you know, I did the Green Hornet, you know, television series back in 65. And as I look around, man, I mean, I saw a lot of human beings. And as I look at myself, I was the only robot there because I was not being myself, and I'm trying to accumulate external security, external uh, technique, uh, the way to move my arm, the way, but never to ask and say what Bruce Lee would have done if, the word if, such a thing happened to me. I mean, here it is, the natural instinct, and here is control. You are to combine the two in harmony, not, if you have one to the extreme, you will be very unscientific. If you have another to the extreme, you become all of a sudden a mechanical man, no longer a human being. So you, it is a successful combination of both. So therefore, it is not only, I mean, so therefore it's not pure naturalness or unnaturalness. The ideal is unnatural naturalness or natural unnaturalness. When I do the Chinese film, I'll try my best not to be as American as I, you know, have been adjusted to for the last 12 years in the States. And, but when I go back to the States, it seems to be the other way around. I mean, it's always that pigtail and bouncing around, chop chop, you know, with the eyes slant and all that. I have already made up my mind that in the United States, I think something about the Oriental, the, I mean the true Oriental should be shown.